Welcome back, everybody, to 7 Days of Night Alpha 21. This is the Apocalypse Ranger series. I'm an old guy gaming, and in this episode, we're going to go out and do another Tier 4 job. Uh, first of all, we have three points available. We are continuing to uh, pump agility. Uh, I'm sorry, not agility, um, intellect. So I think what we'll do is let's put the next point just straight up into intellect. Um, we're, we're also going to invest the next three points that we get into genius and then we will have an effective level 10 and then we're going to get physician all the way up daring adventure all the way up maybe better barter 25 percent better deal you know if we get that maxed out um <clears throat> and i don't know possibly grease monkey we'll see i don't think we need advanced engineering because we have all of the crafting equipment that we need. What does lock picking do? Just faster and less breakage, but lock picks are so cheap and easy to make that uh, that's just not a big deal. Um, speaking of which, though, we should probably put a few more of these in our inventory. I like to to have just a little less than a stack, full stack, so that way, you know, when we loot more, they just add to the stack itself. Okay, uh, let's see. We got all this stuff in here and all this stuff in here to sell, but uh, we're not going to do selling today because uh, the traders reset on day 40, so that'll be tomorrow. In here, I have uh, made a whole bunch of fuel. We already have a full stack of uh, 10,000 in the bike, and uh, looks like we could stand to put a little more fuel in there. And then I think what we'll do is we'll just put the excess fuel up in this cabinet for now. This guy's working on cement and getting some clay smelted back down for us. And I think we're, yeah, in pretty good shape. Pretty darn good shape. I still want to get that daggone um, dirt bike. So um, we definitely want to keep finding vehicle magazines because we have to get to 45 to unlock all the stuff that we need to make the dirt bike. Now we have the dirt bike chassis that we bought, uh, but we have not come across the dirt bike parts yet. Um, so, you know, the cruiser works great. It's, it's awesome. In fact, on, on paved roads, <laughs> but uh, in, you know, like an actual street bike, it doesn't do so well in on rough terrain, <clears throat> but uh, I do like it though. Cause it's got really good speed. And it's got a lot of storage space. The one bad thing about the dirt bike when we get it is it's not it's gonna have the same storage space as the bicycle. But the thing about that thing is it it it'll go over just about any terrain you can think of. I mean it's just amazing on the terrain. And it's at least as fast as this bike, if not maybe even a little faster. Um so it's gonna be very useful, you know, again for getting around in this rough terrain. Okay, so this is I think this is some kind of something or other residence that we got to do. Uh, I won't recognize it or know if it's one we've done before until we get to it. Because I'm still, you know, getting used to all of the new names of the POIs that they added in Alpha 21. A lot of these POIs were in, uh, you know, older versions, but they, they were never named. So what the hell's going on over here? Got some doodles. Got some duffel bags down there. Or cornmeal. Yeah, I want to eat cornmeal out of water that has rotten corpses in it. Yeah, that's going to be healthy. <laughs> Ah, oh, that's funny. Generator bank. Okay, just some kind of weird random POI. What the hell is that, though? It's nothing we can loot. Oh, it's a speaker. That is really weird, man. Hmm. Okay. It looks like, you know, maybe like a... Um, an execution ditch or something. Make him dig a big hole, line him up, shoot him, you know, that kind of thing. I don't know. It's weird. 
Hmm, at first glance... Oh, wait a minute. Is this that same POI that we did several episodes ago? Uh, no, I don't think it is. I think it's a little bit different. Okay. All right, let's put uh, our luckies on here. And we'll check this vehicle. I'm gonna stop uh, wrenching vehicles until, uh, until we can get some points into salvage ops because we can now make our own gasoline. So I don't, that was the main reason why Oh yeah, this is that same house. Okay, uh, I was just on the other side of it. I thought it looked a little bit familiar. All right, well, here. Let's go ahead and start it then. Uh, this is not, by the way, an infested. Uh, it's just a normal, because there wasn't any infesteds available. I don't know if I can run over there and get that arrow without getting out of range. Uh, when I took the quest, so... So this ought to be relatively easy because all of the tier fours we've done so far have been infested. In fact, I think, or at least most of them have been. All right. Are we hungry? Oh yeah, we are hungry. Oh shoot. You know what? I didn't bring any food with me. <laughs> that wasn't very smart. Okay. Well, oh, I'm not going to, uh, that, that we can turn into sham chowder, so I'm not eating it. Hopefully we'll find enough food in, in here to keep us keep us going until we can get through it. Alright, let's put the nerdies back on so that we can get uh, maximum XP. So yeah, we, we randomly uh, did this place uh, several episodes ago now. when it was out in the boonies. Just gonna eat that right now. Take those two things. And uh, what I did at that point in time, we were, we were, you know, quite a bit lower in level. So I just kind of put a, a ladder here as a quick escape. But with our park parkour, yeah, we can just jump out of there, so we don't even need to put a ladder there. Okay, let's do this. Nobody in this room. Where the hell did you come from? A little bitch gave me an abrasion. I have no idea where he came from. <laughs> I didn't see him anywhere. Okay. Not that substantial up there. Woke up two Zikaroos. One's a feral. They're both ferals. And they're dead. Dead as a doornail. Oh, that's an outside Zikaroo. Okay, there's going to be somebody right around the corner here. 
I'm gonna be able to get a headshot out there. Yes, indeed. Nothing in there. Let's grab the paper here. What is that red thingamadoodle floating over there? I don't know. That's a greenie. Is that a chrysanthemum? It is. It's a chrysanthemum. How funny. That's a greeny Marlini. Uh, let's go around to this side and see if we can get her in the head. There we go. You actually gonna make it down here? Well, if you do, I'll kill you. <clears throat> It'll be the last thing you do. Okay, there's gonna be a uh, a burner in that fire pile. I don't want either one of those things. It's just a matter of seeing where he is because it's so hard to see him. My goodness, I cannot tell where he's at. Right there. Except for I couldn't hit him because the... Wood was in the way. Let me get my arrow back. Alright. Does this stuff still catch you on fire? No, it doesn't. You used to get caught on fire when you walked over that. Unless it's just an RNG thing and I'm, it's not proccing. I don't know. I think there's a military chest back here. Yes, there is. Okay, I'll scrap that and I'll take those things. That's funny that there's a chrysanthemum there. Let's grab some wood, why not? Door's not openable. I don't know where that zombo is. Take that and that. Uh, like we did the last time we were here. Let's make a quick escape route through here. Two points. We need one more point to get that next level of intellect. Let's take this out too so I don't bonk my head on it if I'm in a hurry trying to get out of here. Back, since we're here, let's go ahead and drop some things off in the bike. Where are you at, Zombo? Right. Maybe they're in the garage? I don't know. Check the mailbox. Rifles. And we have a needle and thread all learned. Nothing to loot there. Okay, up the stairs we go. That happened to us last time. Freaking zombies spawning right in front of our face. I wish the game wouldn't do that. 
Very immersion breaking. Ruski. What? That's hacks. Eighteen uh, horn mill. That's pretty good. Handgun magazine, and I'll take that. Um, let's take this apart for that. Well, you know what? We we've got tons of iron ingots. We don't need to take that apart. The door's already broken. Zookaroos here. Dispatched. Okay, give us some something good. Okay, that's good. And that's good. That's a uh, desk is not lootable. Oh, look at that. Nice. We can now make the AX scope. We'll be doing that for our sniper rifle. There's a safe behind that picture the last time we were here. What? Did I loot both of those? I don't remember looting one. That's weird. That door's locked. Did I loot both? I, I, I totally don't remember looting <laughs> both of those. I'm losing my mind. Okay, this is ambush country. But the last time we moved through here, we, we were able to stealth our way through and kill everybody. Let's see if we can do it again. And the damn smiter, a uh, smiter, spider snuck up on us. Oh shit! Oh. I think that deserves a bandage. Trying to get in through here? Oh, he's over there. Okay. Okay, we'll have a couple more. Psalms in here. Very good. I think there's a little bit of an ambush in this area too. There's somebody in a cabinet. Yep. All right, it's one of those deals where they can't break out. All right. Let's deal with him. I don't know where my bolt went. Big food pile. We're going to eat that because we don't have much food with us. 
ammo pile. Oh, look at that. Beautiful. I wish we could put these on the knife. Um, I don't know. We can't put it on that. We already got one on there. We already got one on there. And we got one on there, too. Can we put it on here? Sh no, we can't. Okay. Well, we'll just hang on to that for something else later, I guess. There we go. All right, that takes care of the kitchen. And uh, up the stairs we go. Die, sucker. Got some friends in here. Dispatched. Guess that's all the loot in here. Mr. Cuffs. <laughs> Nothing over there. Out the window we go. There's supposed to be a bird out here. Maybe not. Anything behind here? Nope. Alright, these are the trap rooms. Oh shit. Messing around with a greenie. Nice, we got some blue dye. Why don't we put that on our sniper rifle? Very good. Okay, before we go through there, need to get these thingies. All 
Alright, I'll play your game. Not gonna rush me, huh? All right, nice. I like that mod. I always get a kick out of the fact that the Zeeks still do like their their little death uh, noise, even when their head is completely decapitated. It's like, how does that work? <laughs> I guess if the voice box goes with the head, well, no, because they don't have any they don't have any air in their lungs to to do it. I know. Don't think too hard about it. It's it's just funny. I get a kick out of it. Tactical warfare. Hey, cut that shit out! Just screw up my stealth attack, dude. Last time we came through here, I named this the House of Darlene. I don't think we've come across a single Darlene this time around. These any better than what we got? They are, actually. Look at that. All right, let's scrap these and um, scrap this. We will pull these off. Put these on after we modify them. And yeah, we'll just scrap these. I should actually be wearing those. Oh, there's a vehicle book. Cool. All right, let's uh, let's jump down and offload a few things before we go up there, so I don't have to come back up there again. All right, here we go. Up to the attic. This is where the fun will... The fun will be. But, we put our cards right, we'll be able to kill all these guys and not wake any of them up. Maybe. We'll see. In case we do... Um, yeah, so much for that. <laughs> I guess it wasn't meant to be. Oh, we only woke one Zeke up, though. Alright, that works. There we go. We are finished with clearing the area. And we got another meat stew. We're just going to take that right now. Nothing. 
nothing behind there. Okay, let's open up all of these first. And I forgot my eye candy again. But we do have our luckies on. There we go. Don't think we can use that on the crossbow, though. But if we go back to a compound bow at some point, that'll be handy. Another vehicle book. Nice. Um, but we don't actually need to eat right at the moment, so we'll save that. Nope, nope, nope. Don't hit it. Don't break it, man. Steel shovel, nice, but it's a shitty one, so let's scrap it. And uh, that is everything except for the fat loots. Nice magnum treasure chest, or map, rather. Full auto mod. Yeah, decent stuff. Okay, let's go do our turning. And uh, we'll probably go ahead and do that map too before I wrap things up. I'd shake your. Damn. That's definitely worth the most money, so we'll take that. Hey, look at that. We're finished with tier four. Wow. Military armor bundle or four by four parts bundle? Ooh, wow. I think we should. That's, that's tempting. Um, um, you know, this is tempting, but if this allows us to actually make a four by four, I think that's going to be a little more valuable to us than this. Cause we're, we'll eventually come across all of the military armor and, you know, we'll eventually be able to make this too, but this is still a ways off. So I think we're going to do the four by four parts bundle. All right, special jobs. Listen up, jackass. Trader you Joel. Won't work? Yeah. Then show what are you standing That's probably there the for? Trader Joel that we Don't already you have know. Work to do. Yep, it is. Okay. Um, you have any infesteds? I'd go broke with more customers like you. He's got Name's not important. What is important is if you Jack's have lumber mill. We haven't even done that normally. Good Let's luck. do it. You better not make me regret this. We'll try that. Okay. So, um, let's pop this treasure map. Okay. It's uh, right by that POI there, which I think was the lodge that we did. Now, does this actually give us all the parts we need to make the 4x4? Four four? Gives us the accessories and three vehicle magazines and a battery. Okay. Alright, um, <clears throat> kind of, maybe I should Maybe I should have taken the armor after all. That's kind of lame. But, I mean, how far out are we from being able to actually make a 4x4? Yeah, see, we're, we're a long ways off from that. So, we don't even necessarily need to make the 4x4 itself, but there's a lot of other vehicles that we can make, you know, um, <clears throat> like the hum the Humvee and so forth. Okay, yep, it's good. Um, all right, let's go. Let's go do this treasure real quick, and then we need to wrap things up. Okay, nice little collection of ammo and a little bit of coin. Not too bad. I haven't found the treasures to be. 
really fantastic though in this top 21. They're okay, but they're not the coolest thing ever. All right, guys. Well, that is it for this episode. So uh, I'm going to go back to the base, drop stuff off, and then we might... Um, we might try that infested lumber mill in the next episode and later on in the this in-game day. We'll see how our time goes. Anyways, thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share the video. And we'll catch you all in the next episode. Bye-bye.